They, I believe they did it, if I remember, because May is a Mental Health Awareness Month. Oh, so okay, I'm with it, that. They did it for that. I'm with that, I'm with that. I just think it's very weird to call it the Angry Meal. The last yeah. thing I need to see, no shade. I love him for who he is and his presence in the community. I don't need to see Thunderlit storming out of venue. I need to say it. Giants was the closest Burger King. He's like, I need an Angry Meal <laughs> on deck. <laughs> <laughs> we finally got a match, All right. <laughs> saving me from thinking about Burger King's so angry sorry. meals. Oh, because, the lightning loops! Yeah, Parappa <laughs> might need an angry meal after this. Cause... Oh my goodness, Ryu's looking pissed. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, sorry. All right. Anyway, so he. Oh my gosh. Ooh, oh my. <laughs> Wait. Okay. Oh he got nothing off of that, but it looks so right. nice. So let's talk about this matchup a little bit because I feel like now that rage has been scaled down a bit in this game, this matchup can be kind of hard for Ryu. Because very much so. It looks Okay, he's tiny. Really? Yeah, he's just too tiny for anything to connect consistently. And the combo potential is there, and Ryu's just so big. And he got two frame with a forward air. I don't think it was two frame. Maybe it was just like the hand sticking out before his actual like uh, grab hitbox for the uh, ledge came out. But regardless, he's getting just like off stage. He's just getting slapped for it. Mm. Ew. The one, two, three. I didn't say that. <laughs> but the one and two are blocked. <laughs> Tension does it right back to him. But feel like sometimes you just gotta do it. Just raw. Like, are you gonna block this? Yeah. And that time he wasn't. But you only get a couple of those each set, and having yeah. to burn your hand that early doesn't really bode well for you. But at the same time, also opens up the mind game to like, he he just did it. So he could also be very willing, just be ready to do it again. And it may just force uh, tension to like stay in shield, mm. and maybe he can get a grab off it if uh, tension doesn't react fast enough. Yeah, and Tenshin, I have to say, he switched over to Pikachu um, pretty recently, like in the last two months or so. And it's been working out really well for him. I'm glad he took my advice because I was telling him Pichu sucks for a long yeah. time. And okay, I don't think, okay. when I say Pichu sucks, I it's not that Pichu sucks. It's that Pichu is very inconsistent and you have to play it's tough. You have to look the March Fair is razor thin. Like Void makes it work because like he's so used to just like playing Sheik and just these little like micro movements. There's like the micro spacing. He knows what he wants. I hate that word, but I agree. Sorry, I'm sorry. No, you're you're but you're right. You're right. <laughs> like Void makes it work because he's Void, but very few players outside of that can make it work consistently. Yes. Pikachu though, a bit heavier and has more tools for um, combo ability. Well, I can't even really say more that. More leeway in general. I feel. Yeah, more leeway. Like for example, all his aerials auto cancel out of short hop. Why? <laughs> Pika power. Pika power. Power to the Pika. I want to see some Hadoukens in this joint. Ooh, surprised he didn't get the second multi-hit there. Or any, yeah, he yeah, just actually, got hit with one. Just one, I was like, I was for sure like he's gonna get dragged for that. But now, despite how difficult the matchup looked at first, Parappa's doing a good job bringing it back until that one edge guard goes all the way out there with that forward air. All right. Attention, just kind of dancing around, and he knows Parappa's gotta make a move. Probably can't really just like Hadouken, he can just crouch shield under it. So, a bit of dancing here, but probably. Ooh, okay. That's he had a hit for tilt. <laughs> like we saw there, he stayed in the shield, ready for like the Shoryu, and he opted for a focus, trying to see if uh, attention would press the button. Mm -hmm. But almost all his aerials are multi hit, save for down up air. air and up air, I believe, actually. Yeah, and I feel like around this percent, the way that uh, Parappa's playing, sure you can should kill, just the way that he's spacing for it. Oh, oh my god, he exploded. He gets it. <laughs> yeah, that would have killed like 10 I don't miss ago. that. I'm so glad, like, Bash doesn't play for you anymore. <laughs> god, he just used to do it. Oh my god. It would just happen. So yeah. Wait. Oh, it only gets one hit in the air, and this is some big damage, 51%, functionally even, considering the weight differences. I don't know, maybe I saw it wrong, but it looked like, I thought for sure. He, uh, Parappa got hit by like two hits of the Nair there, but maybe, maybe I was wrong. Nah, I think he just got hit by one. The Nair hitbox, I need to see some hitbox yeah, visualizations no, on it. Oh, but Mrs. Shoryuken that likely would have, definitely would have killed. What am I saying? And yeah, so now, alive. Parappa turned it right back around with that one Shoryu and a good, like, uh, edge trapping on his part. Oh, the oh. patience, but he was a bit too far. He was hitting with the crouching short and just with, I mean, uh, crouching down, down tilt. tilt. Yeah, sorry, Street Fighter and me. Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> All right. Ooh. Okay. Out so, of shield, yeah. Uh, what's it called? Pikachu's pancaking, actually saving him from that Shoryu there. Because it doesn't scoop as well as, like, Snake's up tilt, let's say. And that's why a lot of matchups against small characters can be pretty hard for Pikachu. Or, excuse me, pretty hard for Ryu sometimes. 
Oh man, this is getting so close. Next close. mid hit can do it. Ascension sets up for a big edge guard. Goes for a forward smash. Very safe. And that now. auto cancel though. Good fade away. Not getting caught by the Shoryu. Yeah, Pikachu's forward air. Extends his hitbox pretty far forward. So it'll snap right back after the animation ends. What safe. I want to see Good is reaction. like. Parappa the parry, the last hit of something. Shoryu. It, he's looking for it. It oh. might do it, but dash attack, the one option that everyone always forgets about. Pikachu has such a variable kill game that by the time you get hit by dash attack, you're, like, you're, like, you're looking for the back airs. You're looking for the forward airs, the up airs. Just like, right, Edge guards, up till thunder. Your, he catches your landing, and then you're dead. I'm like, Ooh. Yeah. And that, yeah. not for nothing, that's actually really risky against Ryu because if he had decided to focus stack that, the lag is unreal. Yes. You get a level two focus, crumple, sure you. Easy. You could probably kill him before the crumple just dash out of here. No, Parappa was definitely doing well um, for that game. Things were looking very grim from the start, but second sucks, third suck. Uh, brought it right back. It was doing well, putting tension on edge. And so if you can take that, translate it into the second game, then this game could very well go to him. Keep that energy. I'm with it. So two back airs. Staying back on stage. And I like how he went for the, um, the Thunder suit. Jolt on the top suit, just to try and force a better edge guard situation. Taking the damage and oh, four is gonna clank with Shuffle Nets. Yeah, almost any move clanks with it. It's a really interesting one. Ooh. Oh, one, two, three, three piece combo. Burn and that's something on. I also always forget with Ryu. Yeah, you can just you no matter you get your own cross up like confirmation. You can, like cross up there, just hit those jabs, cause like you auto turn around. It's yeah. kind of insane. <laughs> it's a really interesting change. I've heard a lot of Ryu and Ken players lament early on, but now I don't hear it all less. Forward. Imagine, like, because I know, like, situationally, I don't think it's going to come up. But, like, it's, let's say you have someone trapped on ledge, and, like, they neutral get up, or they roll past you, rather, and you're, like, covering for that, so you just down something, you will correct yourself so you're facing them, and then just catch the roll. Yeah. I mean, it was a thing that I liked early on, but I feel like later on, maybe they stopped complaining about it as much, or maybe Ryu and Kenmane just stopped existing. Yeah, There's very too, few yeah. of them yeah. left. <laughs> Parappa's sticking to his guns, and that's well, why the, the kill one, power. One, two, three is going to take the second stock. Parappa's definitely, like, warmed up. He's like, all right, Brad, I know what you got. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh. Okay, a little baby gift there. I mean, if he had um, maybe hit the nair a little bit earlier, he might have been able to confirm into a 50-50 or no down air, because that's how yeah. it works in Smash 4. And Smash 4 was less deadly because you just air dodge, but yeah. now... But now with only one air dodge moves. and so much lag... In yeah, it could be very bad. Tension looking oh. maybe a little bit confused as he beats out the folks with the back air. And oh, he hold on to his jump and he's gonna show you make it back. Yeah, jump hats him. It worked like that in Street Fighter 4 as well, so good little homage to that game. Going way deep. He dead? No. Oh, it was back air. <laughs> the SWAT. <laughs> and it killed him. The SWAT. He's like, kind of waited. He's like, what are you going to do? <laughs> <laughs> it sounds like he hit him with a wet noodle. Yeah. <laughs> oh, the sound effects in this game are great. Oh. And now, Parappa. I have this percent, one, two. Yeah, he's looking for a one, two, sure you. He's going to finish. No. Oh, okay. I thought he was going to turn it around. And that was such an awkward situation. It was that like, like a little compact. Oh, okay, there we go. Oh, and he he's lived. Alive. Okay. I guess Rage hadn't started yet. It starts around 35%, so. That might be why. It looked like he was right at the edge of that blast zone, but next one he can't afford to take. But next one might not even be a sure you can up smash or forward smash could do it too. So what I was going to say on that like whole platform it was like almost like a condensed lightning. Loop. Just kind of like poking around with the nares, the back airs. Oop. Or to go oh, for heavy jab, heavy jab. Was that was that heavy jab? I think it was, I think I saw his leg come up. It was hard to tell, but it was a heavy enough hit that almost killed. I just forget the input for it. Like the roundhouse is held jab, I think. I'm so sorry, Ryu remains around the world. I only know it from his animation as a Street Fighter. That's <laughs> that's the worst thing about commenting his matches. Like I know him from Street Fighter. I know him from Street Fighter three, four, five. So I call it like short or roundhouse sometimes. Yeah, yeah it's annoying. Yeah. But now, yeah, even though tension's, right, tension's, he's, he's staying alive. He's, he's a whole stock down, though. Like, literally, like, one touch, he could be dead. He saw that, like, Roundhouse almost take the stock. 
I think Sour Shore will kill, honestly. Honestly, I think, yeah, Parappa's fishing for something. Next, oh, anything. Tatsu. Tatsu. Hit him with the knee. That'll do it. And Parappa takes the game. It's very convincing this time around, actually. Yeah. Oh, very far cry. And I feel like what really changed is how much he gets off of his confirms. Yes. Like, as we saw in the uh, first few stocks, around 70%, he just walked up, jabbed him twice, sure you can need die. Sure you, and he's gone. It's like, holy crap. Yeah. So when you're taking away stocks that early, it really doesn't matter what happens the first 20, 30 yeah. seconds. It's just, hey, I'm Ken? playing my game plan. Oh, first second. Ken, Ken, Ken Masters? Ken Masters. Okay, Fox, okay. So this matchup is much, much more different. Thank you, Sakurai, for kind of neutering Ryu's oppression against Fox. Like, okay, Smash 4, people will say, like, Ryu mains, will, <laughs> Ryu mains will cry, oh, Fox bodies Ryu. And then Fox mains will cry, Ryu bodies Fox. Well, we can agree that Ryu would, like, not in the matchup, but just, like, face to face, when you got a box, Ryu would murder Fox. I watched Locust so many times just walk at people and up to him. And, like, Foxes, they would just, like, crack. Because there's so much pressure. Yeah. They would die at, like, 40. But not because, like... Because of rage. Yeah. He would walk at people at 150% and kill them. But now this match is completed. You can actually kind of like drown uh, Ryu with hitboxes now, especially as Fox. Yeah, this is the matchup that Ryu mains thought it was in Smash 4. Yeah. It's like a matchup where they could both body each other, but it's a matchup where Fox can kind of oppress yes. Ryu in a more significant and meaningful way. Mostly because up to it no longer has like the oppressive range or hitbox that it once did. Yeah, still good shield pressure though. Definitely. And despite everything we were saying about this matchup being like slanted one way or the other, it's pretty even at the moment as Parappa has to make a recovery back through tensions, ledge pressure, and he almost Ooh. gets a second hit of that up air. Good back air there. He's forced to Tatsu. Nice. He's going to run off, get in there. He's still got to jump, though. There we go. And something to know is that tension did play Ryu in Smash 4, so he's familiar with the fundamentals of this character. That's why he got that punch on the Tatsu a bit earlier, but he still did not see that back air coming. Once again, setting up for another edge guard situation. Tension's got to get the stock soon. Cause like one mean conversion from Parappa could like take him to like killing percents. Yep. There we go. Oh. Finally, the back air to seal it out. And something that Tension always does that he plays so safe when he needs to. It's probably one of the safest boxes I've seen. Yeah. Kind of dancing around. He's got a slight lead not anymore, but kind of waiting for Parappa to pull the trigger. Kind of like empty hopping in front of his face, mm -hmm. trying to see what he does. Also, shouts to Amsa in the chat. Amsa in the chat. Yeah, he raided just a minute ago. <gasps> Big shouts to Amsa. Amsa. Thank you. But right now, Tension setting up for another ledge trap. He hasn't been getting them on He's Parappa very like, often. I think. One, two, sure you two, tie my shoe. Say goodbye to you. That's another stock gone. I don't think it's like completely safe, but like if he like, I'm pretty sure we saw it in the last game. He was clipping. Uh, Ryu's hand with the forward air from uh, Pikachu. Mm -hmm. So if he kind of feels out the timing, oh my gosh. Good punish. Recognizing that his fist goes through that platform and will poke. Oh, that could be you're the dead. and you're gone. He had enough time to dash, dash up. Dash in, kind of wait. And he's gone. Off yeah. the top. Hit him with the three-piece 